Hey, what's up guys, Dre here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to get PPSSPP, which is a PSP emulator back again on your iOS 9.3 device or lower. If you guys go on to enjoy the video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up if you haven't already subscribed, and let's begin with today's tutorial. Now, to get PSP, PPSSPP, it's actually quite easy. iEmulators finally put it back on their site, and if you haven't already checked out iEmulators, the link to the site will be in the link in the description below. But if you do not know what IM layers is or how to even do this, head on over to Safari, type in IM layers at the top, remember link in the description below, go to apps, scroll down all the way until you can find PPSSPP, which is a PSP emulator. Click old. Now remember, if you're on an iOS 6 Plus device, not iOS 6 Plus, but iPhone 6 Plus device, this will look a little bit awkward on your screen. So go ahead and click install. Once you clicked on PPSSPP, it'll ask you dl.boxcloud.com would like to install PPSSPP. Go ahead and click install. Already installed it. Now if you're on iOS 9, here's the trick. You'll click on it. It'll say untrusted enterprise developer. Go to settings. And it's actually quite easy. Head on to general, scroll down all the way until you can find profiles and device management, and then find the actual enterprise developer certificate. Go ahead and click trust, trust again. I'll say trusting, you can go ahead and click on it. But the thing is, for iPhone 6 Plus, which I am on, I have an iPhone 6S Plus, it will look a bit awkward because it has not been updated. This is the old version that they gotten back. So it's going to look a bit awkward if you're on an iPhone 6 Plus, but if you're on an iPhone 6S Plus, 6s and a iphone 5 iphone 4 this will look perfectly fine now if you guys did enjoy the video don't forget to leave a thumbs up this has been druggy and see you guys